What is up you guys? Welcome back to another video, another weekly vlog video this Monday. Happy Monday, good morning. I've been up since 5 a.m. I've been up since before the sun rose. I actually watched the sunrise in my apartment today. It was very cute. I was just laying in bed and I was watching it and it was so orange. I literally took was taking like photos and videos because I couldn't believe how orange the sun looked. Like it was glowing. It was like a cheesy, orange sphere in the sky and it was just radiating and i watched it rise and i've been up forever feels like um i'm on my way to ikea right now I'm headed to ikea with baby um i just need you guys know i wasn't able to get the shelves for my packs unit um because they were sold out of them last time that i went so i'm headed there now um because i know that they'll most likely have them in stock i'm gonna check online but um the girl told me that they were gonna restock them so i'm just gonna get those shelves like i literally i need those so that i can like finish organizing my closet because i just feel like there's so much stuff that's kind of just thrown around right now in there so yeah i got on my pink fitted with my broken nails that i was trying to pop off and my good karma tea and yeah we just got to Ikea! Cut the showroom out and I still feel like I'm walking through everywhere. Nitrous. He's a big ass kid, clearly. He's a big ass kid and all I do is just laugh. That's how he got me, man. That's how he got me. <laughs> I showed him these lantern lights and I was like, should I get these to put along my balcony? And he said, mm, no. Those lights suck. Uh, <laughs> suck is a very strong word. Tell me how you really feel. Don't have blue feet. Don't connect He said they need to have Bluetooth. They need to be color changing. They need to be LED like. Possibly play music. I don't know if they make those. He wants to turn the balcony into a club? Now, what is the name of this thing? The hey, the, the U keyboard. is gone. <laughs> the keyboard is missing. Oh, you letters. can still use it? Okay. You know how old people, they type with like one finger? They'd be like... <laughs> He's like... <laughs> Oh my god! You my business? Hey, they raised the price of this. That's why it was so much last time. Cause I wasn't even supposed to get this size. Where's the shelves? <gasps> Out of stock. Oh my goodness gracious! See so if we can order the house. They're sold out of my shelves still. Um, yeah. Anyway, so I couldn't get nothing. <laughs> They didn't have anything. Womp, womp, womp. They couldn't even order it for me. I went to the information desk and to see if they could order it from the distribution center. Just go to Melrose. Melrose! You yeah, guys, look at these so cute. They look like caramel latte.
place that we were originally gonna go to was actually closed. Um, they closed at 2 p.m. but because it was a breakfast place, but they sold. So basically, Baby saw a Instagram ad for a pulled pork sandwich. And when he clicked on it, he was like, oh, this is not too far. It was in Culver City. So, of course, we drove over here just for the pulled pork sandwich. And then when we got there, they were closed. And they had actually closed 30 minutes prior. So it's getting there. So then he just looked up like pulled pork sandwiches in Culver City and he came across Holy Cow. But I honestly think that this place is better because it's like an actual barbecue um, restaurant. Like they serve a bunch of just barbecued items. They had like, I got brisket and pulled pork and then sides and stuff and he got a pulled pork sandwich because that's what he wanted so we're just waiting for our food now we're sitting outside we have patio seating but it smells really good in there i think it's gonna be really good Wednesday. It's Wednesday. I didn't vlog yesterday. I didn't really do much. I uploaded a video today. The Hawaii vlog went live. I have my mask on because I'm about to go outside. I'm about to go get... I texted. I was watching um, people eat sweetie meals from McDonald's on YouTube. And I made myself really hungry. And then I was just like, I low-key want to try that. But like, it's nothing new. But like, I still want to go get I still want to go get it and I want to try it like her marketing team like did that like that they did that Okay, she did that. So yeah, I'm gonna I texted Bay and I was like, can we go? Can we go and get sweetie meals? <laughs> and he said of course <laughs> So, you know, that's where we're going right now I'm in the car my bun almost got squished by the center Hey, we're gonna try the sweetie meal are you excited? Huh? We're eating sweeties meal. We're eating sweeties meal. Yummy! <laughs> but apparently it's really good. So that's what I was doing for like the last three hours. I was like, hmm, I went on YouTube. You know, YouTube. That's how my um, grandmother says YouTube. She says YouTube. She says, I, I watch a movie on YouTube. I'm like, okay, which movie? Should be watching like black and white movies from like 1910. Yeah, they have like <laughs> yeah, like she'll watch that all day long. That's so funny. So yeah, we f I'm finna try a sweet meal. So it's a Big Mac, a Sprite, a medium Sprite, a medium fry, a four piece nuggets, and sweet and sour sauce and bar barbecue sauce mixed. No, but it's it's the way you're supposed to eat it too. She has like a little menu that you're supposed to um that they you're keep, supposed to do. that you're supposed to do like the way you're supposed to, the way you're supposed to eat it apparently. I get it. Yeah, because I don't think Travis Scott had like a because he had one too. Remember? Yeah, but I think his was the signature was like the biggest or something. Oh, okay. So a little a little story time. I used to walk. Well, I used to walk to school when I was in middle school um, in Brooklyn every single day. And the route that I had to take, I had to pass a McDonald's. Like I had to pass it, and it was also the quickest route too. So, like I would always eat McDonald's in middle school. But then, like I, I just got really turned off by it. like you know when you eat something too much and then you start to hate it. Like that's what happened. I haven't had McDonald's since like. 15 years ago. <laughs> no, like 13 years ago. Yeah. So this shall be interesting. I don't see it on the menu. We just got to McDonald's. We're in McDonald's at Venice Beach. <laughs> don't ask why. Hi. Can I have the sweetie meal? Sorry? Can I have the sweetie meal? Two sweetie meal? Yes. Yes. What can I drink? Sprite. Just Sprite? Yeah. What can uh sweetie sour? You want to change it yourself? No, you can leave it. I'm sorry? You can ha you can leave it the way it is. Can we get extra signature sauce? It's come with the sweet sour. Come with the full sweet sour. 
Okay. You want a frosty or a um, ice cream? You want, do you want that? No. Oh, you sure? No. Yes. No, yeah, I don't. You do. Yeah, you do. Okay. Can I get a um? Can I get an M and M McFlurry? Okay. No, just one. Just can one. Can I get an M and M McFlurry? I'm gonna try yours. That's all me, Big Papa. When you took me to McDonald's, girl. Mm -hmm. I really know mm. how to spoil my man. <laughs> oh, she didn't give me the sweetie bag or the menu. They don't be <laughs> having stuff. Here. I didn't get the menu. I feel like they would have. You're not eating yours now, right? Mm. Can I have a little bit of your McFlurry, love? Mm. Oh yeah, I got you a, a electricity filled Sprite from McDonald's. Really? Yeah. These are the best ones. You know they be putting, that's, apparently hers are extra crispy. <laughs> I'm just saying that though. <laughs> oh my God. Probably the best soda I've had in a week. Really? That's that McDonald's Sprite. Don't don't get used to it though. We need one of those in the crib. A McDonald's Sprite? The whole little machine. <laughs> <laughs> That's wild. Okay, so I got my sweetie meal. Look at her. I wasn't able to get the little menu that it normally comes with because you, you, it comes inside like this little piece of paper that shows you the different ways that she basically can have like she would want you to eat the meal. So I think I'm going to put it on the screen actually right here. I think one of them is the nuggets ripped up on top of the fries and then you put sweet sour sauce all over all of it and then you eat it. The burger is the Big Mac and you open it up, you put the fries first, and then you put the chicken nuggets on top, and then you take a sweet sour sauce, and you put that on top of that, and then you close up the sandwich and you eat it. The last one was like ketchup on the outside of the burger, like on top of the bun, but I'm not doing that, that's too messy. <sighs> I have not had a Big Mac since I was probably like 12 or 13 years old, this is crazy. Look, she even has a little, it says sweetie and sour. <laughs> it says sweetie and sour. I've got my fries. I don't even know if Cactus Jack had all that. I think he did though on the fries. I'm pretty sure he did. You know, this is like, this is really and, nothing and new. This McDonald's merch sells for so much right now. Yeah. This is really nothing new. Cause I remember growing up, going to McDonald's with my dad and he used to put fries every single time on his burger. But I will say, Saweetie, we all know my sis likes to eat good, and she likes to eat a little weird. You know, she likes, she has very, very specific taste buds. I think she challenged basically everyone to try McDonald's, but like in a different way. And I think that's why it's so popular, cause it was like the perfect like marketing and just PR move for her. Like it makes sense, you know? So I got the fries on the burger. I'm busting these fries down though. I love McDonald's fries, I will say that. And then you're supposed to take your four piece nuggets and you're supposed to rip up, literally break up the nuggets and put them on the burger. This is very extra, but oh shoot, I didn't know I was gonna have to. If, th if that don't exist, I need to come up with that. We can pay that ASAP. Sandwich, you ready to go. <laughs> ready to go. Okay, ready? They did not skim to an at max sauce. Not at all. Not bad. Not bad at all. Let me wash it down with the extra strong, extra electricity sprite. What the hell? <laughs> Yo, sparkling water don't even come that come out like that. Don't be surprised though. You like it when I eat. You be at your happiest. You can never smell so much. Food in front of you, anyway. I also take a friggin' boomerang of the food. That didn't happen. That's how hungry I was. Little hungry ass. Little hungry ass. 
Oh, and the camera's about to die. Good morning, vloggy vlog. Happy Thursday. It is Thursday. I'm going to get breakfast. Um, there's this place that I wanted, that I've been wanting to go to, that China actually had when she was here a couple weeks ago, but I didn't end up getting it. I think I had a lash appointment that morning or something like that. So I didn't get to try it, but I want to go to Egg Slut. <laughs> it's this place in downtown LA. They actually have a couple of locations all over LA. Um, but they make like breakfast sandwiches and it is the morning time. I've been up since like 8 30 It's 11 o'clock now. So and I just posted on the gram. Yeah, I'm about to get breakfast. So let's go I got a sausage egg and cheese on a brioche bun with uh, avocado and I told them no honey mustard aioli. Yeah, I'm from New York. We don't put mustard or uh, mayo on our on our bacon or our sausage egg and cheese. It's just, it's against the rules. It's against New York law. Like when I say, let me get a bacon egg and cheese, I don't want no mustard or no aioli on it. That is a fact. Yeah, no. But I am going to enjoy this. And I got a little orange juice. Let's try this. Look at it. It looks so yummy. Very good. The avocado that they put on it, though, is definitely not right. 10 out of 10, I would recommend Exa. It was very, very yummy. Right, babe? Yeah. I mean, it's an egg slice. Uh, it was good. And I like the orange juice too. It tastes like a fresh squeeze. Look, they have the candy covered chili lime, strawberry, sour belt, spicy mango, gummy strawberries. They got blue cream. <gasps> sour belt? Nah, they got all of them. Oh my goodness, do they have gushers? Yeah. You guys, I just got to Universal Studios. We're doing spontaneous things today. Only. We did not plan on being here, but we're here now. And I've actually never been to Universal Studios in California. I've been in Florida before, but I've never been here. So I'm excited. I need to put my mask on. I will say I don't like roller coasters, like big ones, but I'll go on the, you know, the ones that don't, don't go too crazy. But I'm really just here for the vibe, you know? He doesn't like roller coasters, but he would jump out of a plane. Make it make sense. And the shoes, they're so cute. Baby got keys. This 
ball is going to be seen on screen at a distance, out of focus, behind the main actors through that one lens of the camera. The highlights and shadows of the building are going to pop so that it looks like an extension of the street. That little area is known as London Square. The grassy park would be perfect for a wedding reception or turn it into a creepy cemetery. And just around the corner from London, we can go to New York. Welcome to New York Street. We've got a financial district on the right, the Macy's type building, Broadway style theaters here in the center. The one on your right hand side was turned into a nightclub on the outside for Fast and Furious 8. And no one knows more about this area than my very own co host, Jimmy Telmavatic. No, thank you. I got, this is my drink that I got. It tastes really good. I like it. I'm just, I feel like I'm still not done though. There's a couple more things I'm gonna get. This is what the car looking like. Alrighty, just got back from El Supermercado. <laughs> I got all my three usable bakes. Filled with groceries. And surprisingly enough, I only spent a hundred dollars and I got mad stuff and I still have my Starbucks drink It's very good and it didn't upset my stomach at all as I suspected because I got oat milk quick little grocery haul I got some orange chicken. I really like this brand. I've had it a bunch of times California pizza kitchen Chicken Sam um, barbecue chicken pizza. Why can't I speak? Oh my goodness. I got this. Just look at it. There it is. You guys, I'm I just walked into my I just walked into my lobby of my building and the concierge person had a baby kitten, like a baby kitten. And it was literally the cutest freaking thing ever. And I was sitting, I, I walked in and I like stopped because I saw the kitten. Like me and the kitten made eye contact and then it like trotted up to me. I can't even say run because it was like still trying to figure out how to use its legs. <laughs> 
It was so cute. It just like pranced over to me and then it was just standing under me and I stopped and I was just looking at my feet and I was like, this is literally the cutest freaking thing ever. Like what? If I wasn't allergic to cats, I would have picked that kitten up and probably ran with it. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm not going to steal somebody's. No, but seriously, that cat was so cute. It was a kitten. It was so freaking cute and it's little, little paws. So now that's what I'm going to be thinking about for the rest of the day. Okay. So I got the orange chicken right, and then I got classic chicken. I got eggs. I got fried rice. I really like this veggie fried rice. I got seasoned waffle cut fries. Um, I got classic cut bacon for breakfast to go with the croissants and the eggs. Salmon. I got strawberries and raspberries. I got boneless, no, boneless steak. What is this? Boneless beef. That's what I got. I got these Balance Break Sargento three pack snack packs. I really like these. They give me like adult Lunchables vibes. This one has cheddar cheese, sea salted roasted almonds, raisins, and Greek yogurt drops. So it's a sweet one. This one is the one I got last time. Monterey Jack mild cheddar and wheat thins. I got Colby Jack shredded cheese. I got carrots. I got red potatoes. I've got white peaches. They have yellow peaches and they have white and I got white. And then I got heavy cream. Yeah, I got a jug of water. I never have too much water. I need to drink some water now actually. I got more coconut waters because they were on sale too. Love coconut water. Oh, I got this huge tub of creamy peanut butter. This is gonna be great for putting in smoothies. I got a hint of honey, almond breeze, almond milk, and then baby picked out watermelon juice. That's everything that I got from the supermarket. So I'm about to put it away. You guys, I literally haven't spoken to you all day. I was filming and it was on this here. Look how cute it is though. Now I'm at I'm at Berkshire House. I'm waiting on Mona to get here so that we can have drinks and girl talk because we miss each other and it's been a little minute since we've seen each other. So it was very like spur of the moment, but I think that it's very much needed, you know? So I'm just waiting for her to get here. She said her Uber's like 15 minutes away. afternoon good afternoon vloggy vlog happy sunday it is sunday it's the last day of the weekly vlog i just got all glammed to finish some tiktoks that i was working on but also just because like i needed to get cute and i need to take pictures for this wig actually this wig install i need like a thumbnail photo i got all cute and all glam i'm actually about to go to like this food truck fair or I don't know if they're all gonna be food trucks, but there's gonna be like food stands and stuff. But basically it's like a little food fair. It's called Smorgasburg. It's in downtown LA. It's only on Sundays from 12 to four. So it's a little after one right now. So I'm about to head over there now. I'm really excited because I haven't eaten yet. All I had was a smoothie this morning that baby made for me. So I definitely have an appetite. There's probably gonna be like a couple things that I wanna try. Hopefully it's like a lot of good stuff. I think it is though, cause I've been to Smorgasburg in New York City actually. So if it's anything like that, then I'm gonna be all for it. You know how I feel about food. A girl likes to eat. So how are you guys feeling the blonde? So I have on this little, this top has like a matching skirt, but I'm not wearing the skirt cause it's like really dressy. I got this in Mexico actually. Um, and then these shorts I've had for ages. I think they're from Forever 21. Just have on some little denim shorts. And then I have on my, the Hyper Royal ones. Mom two, call my Uber. I think I'm gonna get Starbucks first and then call my Uber to Smorgasburg. So I'll see you guys there. Just got to Smorgasburg.
something to drink. It's so hot and there's no sun, I mean no shade. The lines for everything are really long, so I'd honestly suggest getting here earlier than we did. There's a lot of people here, but there's a lot of good looking food also. It's barbecue sold out, sold out. Sold out. I got my food. Guys, look at this booth that I found where you can make your own dried flower bouquets. I'm gonna make one. It's a dry flower bar. Isn't that so cute? Okay, how do I do this? Okay, so if you need help, I can help you out. Strawberry cookie crunch, ice cream, and fruity pebbles. I don't want to bite into it with my teeth. You gotta bite it. Is it good? Okay, you guys, I'm back home. Hey, focus on me, girl. Anyway, um, back home watching Nine Perfect Strangers on Hulu right now. I'm making dinner for me and babe, and I was like, I could put my my little flower arrangement that I bought today. That my little flower arrangement that I bought today. <laughs> I could put it in in this vase that I have. Um, oh, and I'm making orange chicken and fried rice, vegetable fried rice dinner, and some. Um, what are these? I have pork dumplings that I'm gonna make. Oh, she said I have to cut it. Chad, you laughing? What you laughing at? Ah! Look how pretty! It looks like this is the hair for this face. Well, maybe I can just fluff it out and stick some of these in the middle. There's like, I got three pink ones and then three yellow ones. Just add freaking a uh, flower arrangement maker to my long list of skills. Add it to the resume. Ooh, stop playing, stop playing, what up? 
so pretty. His name can be Duke. No. <laughs> You're laughing at my plant names. I'm weak. Wait, okay, let me put this. I thought you was over there laughing at videos. You laughing at my plant names. At my children. Um, I was gonna call him Duke. This is my new pompous. Um, I got it from I have the sweet peony. Her name is Jessica. Shout out to Jessica. She helped me today. She was very sweet. So cute. It's Sunday. Oh, so that means that that's the end of this week's vlog. I'm sad. It was a good one. We did so much stuff this week, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, comment down below what was your favorite part of this week's weekly vlog. Don't forget to give this video a huge thumbs up down below. Go ahead and smash the like button right now because that lets me know that you want to see more weekly vlog videos from me. Don't forget to click that subscribe button down below and turn on your post notifications because it's going to be your three times a week. Okay, period. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget, you are smart, you are beautiful, and people love you. I love you, and I can't wait to see you in my next upload. Bye.